These are my clownfish, and this is an anemone. Anemone? Anemone? Now you might be wondering, Grant, why are you buying a second one when you already have one anemone already? Well, not only have the clownfish not hosted in it, but it's also a great excuse for me to ruin my bank account. So make sure you like this video so I can sustain my V-Buck addiction. Now the absolute goal, obviously, like every clownfish owner is for them to host inside of the anemone. I'm not guaranteeing that they will do that during this video, but I will guarantee you that we will get a absolute sick anemone. I don't have a dripper, so all I used was a little cup to acclimate them very, very slowly and then after about 30 minutes added this bad boy to the tank and which was extremely extremely scary because this thing almost went down into the rocks where I would never see it again but thankfully when I put it into the tank it did not go that way and this is exactly what it's looking like after the third day of being in the aquarium right and it is looking amazing the red colors even in the blue light it looks actually way better in the blue light but have the clownfish gone into 